Coronavirus is making a record shattering resurgence across the U.S. It sure is. And now L.A. County health officials say they may take drastic steps to slow the spread. CBS 2's Tina Patel is live this morning in La Puente with the latest on this story. Tina, good morning. Good morning. We are at St. Joseph Catholic School, which is actually going to resume in person learning today. They got a waiver, so they'll be having about 70 students return, and they say they have taken all the precautions necessary in the school to keep their students and staff safe. Unfortunately, it seems that there are a lot of places and people not being as careful. Take a look at this. LA County is continuing to see a rise in the number of new cases and people testing positive for COVID-19. Now they say it's partly due to an increase in the number of people getting tested, but the rate of infections is also up, as is the number of people being hospitalized. Health officials worry that COVID fatigue has set in, that people are letting down their guard, not social distancing like they should. The Board of Supervisors say they do not want to impose more lockdowns, but they are considering other options to slow the spread of the virus, like a possible curfew. We talked to one Pasadena resident who works in healthcare, and she knows how serious this situation is. So I see what it does to these patients, and it's it's pretty debilitating, but I, then I also walk down Colorado Boulevard, and I see all the, the businesses struggling, and especially the local ones. Like, it's sad to see all the stuff. A very tough situation we find ourselves in, but this morning we do have some promising news about a COVID vaccine. Moderna, the latest drug company that says its shot appears to provide strong protection against coronavirus. Now their announcement comes just a week after Pfizer said their vaccine trials were 90% effective. Both companies are now trying to get approval for emergency use from the U.S. government, so that could be very good news. Back out here live, schools say they are being cautious when they are getting the okay to reopen. St. Joseph's will only be having students from TK through second grade coming back full time. The students in the upper grades are not coming back unless they need special services. They're trying to be very cautious as they make slow progress in this fight. We'll send it back to you.